Thanks, Kyle, for sitting with us and talking. Um, the first question I have is about the, the new encoders. So we're calling them multi-codec dual stream encoders. Um, I understand they can stream, you know, both the MWC stream and the H.264, but what are some of the, the details of that? Well, thanks for uh, having me, Colin, and, and inviting me to uh, partake in the questioning here. Um, so some of the, uh, the features, right, of, of MWC and uh, the H.264, um, the, the, the encoder itself has a MWC, right, the codec, motion wavelet codec, and that's the high quality, low latency 4K6444. We also have the H.264 stream uh, as part of the encoder, and that's really the secondary uh, stream that it does. Now, the, 26, the N2600 uh, models that have the S designation, uh, stands for streaming, right, is, is where we've got that from. That is what has the H.264 or and MWC. Um, the N2600S models allow for MWC streaming only. You, you can disable the H.264 or you both have MWC and H.264 streaming. So tell me a little bit more about this MWC. What, is that, what does that stand for and what does that uh, codec really do? Sure. So MWC is Motion Wavelet Compression. Um, it's a 4K60, 444, uh, you know, ultra high quality you know, codec. Um, it's uh, great for you know, that the in-room experience where you know, you've got some sort of reference to a live presentation. You know, you're not gonna detect any of the, you know, the following of the mouse. So as real the real low mouse, latency? It, absolutely, right, as it moves around the screen. Um, you know, that, that's really, you know, it's, the, it's a high bandwidth uh, a stream at that point. So it's really good for video? Yep, so it's excellent for video. It's excellent for uh, looking at spreadsheets, looking at PowerPoints, you know, that fixed content that is traditionally a little bit more difficult to actually reproduce through network AV. Okay, so just a high quality one gig codec for video within a, within the room, within the building. And then you've also added the H.264. Uh, absolutely, so we've added a, a secondary stream uh, as an H.264. Um, and that's available as either 720p or a 1080p encoding to the network. Okay. Um, and really what the, what the idea there was is that in a lot of the hybrid environments that we have today, you know, post pandemic, there's always a remote component it feels like at some point. And what this allows for is streaming to uh, internet services such as Panopto or YouTube, uh, you know, Facebook, Wowza, where your audience may not all be able to be in the same room together. So we're allowing and enabling folks to be able to have a distance component to really bring everybody into that meeting. Mm -hmm.